Hey guys, so today's tutorial is on a Dutch crown braid. So to begin, you want to make sure your hair is tangle free and parted down the side. Next, you want to take a section towards the top of your head and divide it into three equal strands. Then you want to take the strand closest to your face and place it underneath the middle strand. Then take the outside strand and place it underneath the middle strand. Then you're going to take that same strand closest to your face, add in a section of hair with it, then place them both underneath the middle strand. Then you're going to do the same thing with the strand farthest from your face. You're going to add in a section of hair with it and then place them both underneath the middle strand. So again, take the strand closest to your face, add in some hair with it, and then place them both underneath the middle strand. Take the outside strand, add in some hair with it, and then place them both underneath the middle strand. Then you keep repeating. So one more time, you're gonna take that strand closest to your face, add in a section of hair with it, then place them both underneath the middle strand, and then take the strand farthest from your face, add in some hair with it, and place them both underneath the middle strand. Then you just keep repeating these steps until you're a little bit past your ear. So this hairstyle is awesome for short, medium, or long hair. If you have short hair, you just have to do it a little bit different. If you have long hair, you just have to do it a little bit different as well. But it's a hairstyle that looks great on everyone. So once you get past your ear, then you're going to switch up your hands. So here I am switching my hand placement. I can't even like try to explain how to do that. So it took me a little bit to figure it out, but just practice. And then you just want to continue those same repetitions towards the back of your head. So you want to make sure that you're adding in just enough hair to reach the other side of your head. And then once you reach the other side of your head and all your hair is in the braid, then you just want to finish it off into a regular three strand braid. So then you just want to tie it off into a clear elastic. And then this is what it should look like. So here I'm just going to go in and pancake my braid a little bit. So I'm just tugging on the outside pieces, just kind of pinching and pulling and doing the same in the back. So just tugging on the outside edges of each part of the braid. So now you want to take the end of the braid and you're going to place it over the top of your head and then you're going to bobby pin it in place. So here I'm just kind of moving down my elastic a little bit and then I'm just going to bobby pin it in place and I use two bobby pins here and you can kind of see it poking out a little bit but once we pancake our braid you won't see it. So once you do that then you just want to go back and pancake your braid some more. So just do it until you like how it looks. Um, what I didn't show is that I did go back and just kind of put more bobby pins into my Dutch braid all around my head just to make sure that it's secure throughout the day. And here I'm just taking down some hair by my ears and then curling it. And this is the completed look, so it's super easy. It took me literally, I think, six minutes to do. So I hope you guys like this hairstyle and we'll give it a try. Please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.